Yo, I ain't here for the money, I ain't here for the fame. So anyways guys, today I'm going to be teaching you how to do the slow motion before a kill effect that a lot of pro highlight editors have been using lately. And so to start, we have our timeline, we have the clip that we want to use, and we also have our song. I've already marked these things just to make it easier, you know. To separate these, you can just press Ctrl and L because we're going to be time remapping this with Twixter, which is a plugin that you're going to need to install first in order to do this. You could also do this without Twixter, but Twixter just looks nicer. Now let's listen to the song first. Alright, basically on this beat here that I've marked already, I want to shoot and get the kill. And where he goes like, yeah, and that's where I want to have the slow motion. And basically where you start the slow motion, you're going to want to have where you, your character starts pulling out the shotgun and then line that up with where you want the slow motion to start. Put time remapping. You're going to click this to make some keyframes. I like to go where I want the slow motion completely there. I think here is fine, my bad. I'll put that to 25. All right, so this is what it looks like. Oh. And then basically, obviously, this is too slow still, right? So we want the speed to pick back up. Roughly here, I'll want the... I'll put another keyframe for 25% speed. And then I'm going to come over here, put this back to 100 and see if it's fine. Obviously, it's not. It's still not. So I'm just going to make this so fast to the point where I shoot, which is here. And then I'm going to go. This frame already is where my beat is that I want the kill to be on. So I'm going to go this one frame out and go back down to 25%. That doesn't look good, so I'm going to go back and I'll put I'll go two frames out and then go to 25 here. This is one frame before the beat where I want the kill to be. And now I'm going to go two frames out and put the speed back to 25. And now this should look good. Yes, that's what I'd like to see. And at the end of the clip, I'm going to want it to go faster again, right? So it goes slow, really fast, slow, right, on the beat, on my clip, and well, at the end, I'll drag this all the way out, put the speed back to 100, and then I'll save it as well. And I've screwed something up. Right, I'll drag this out a bit more, and then put it back to 100 at the end of the clip. That should look good. Anyway, I'm just gonna remove this out. Yo, I ain't here for the money, I ain't here for the fame. Though it might be nice to own a jet plane, I'ma do it all for you. Come along and 